All right, welcome back. My name is Brian, and you found the Backwoods Adventure Incorporated channel with the Adventure Crew. Today we're going to be talking about Afterburn Lighted Crossbow Knocks, and these are going to be Half Moon. You know, I go to eBay for a lot of my archery stuff. This is coming from Archery Mall. This is the packaging that is going to come in, but this is actually what the picture is going to look like when you order it. So just don't be alarmed. It's going to come like this, but that's the picture right there. Uh, what they're actually going to look like when you order these things. You know, I've never had a problem with them. I've ordered from them before. Instructions, how to turn it on and off. But I, we're going to dive down the table. I'll, I will show you that. I'm going to install it on my bolt. We're going to come back up top, talk about it a little bit more. And uh, one of my friends was talking to me the other day. And he was just like, hey, Brian, why ain't you using the bow no more? It's because of COVID. I actually sold my, I actually sold my bear bow just to make a couple payments on a couple things that we were back behind because, you know, this COVID thing has got everybody backwards so i'm using my crossbow i might be getting a new bow here shortly so stay tuned for that one but let's dive down the table let's check out these afterburn lighted crossbow half moon knocks come back up top and i'll talk about them a little bit more so let's get down to the table and check out the afterburn lighted crossbow knocks half moon let's get on the table Alrighty, here is your packaging for your Afterburn Lighted Crossbow Knox. Let's go ahead and take this stuff out. I'm just going to rip that open get that out of the way. Let's go ahead and take out the information here. So it's going to say Afterburn Lighted Crossbow Knox. You know, they are Half Moon, which I ordered. They're actually going to put an extra 30 grain, uh, 30 grains to uh, your arrow. Long battery life, and these are lithium ion batteries. You know, your diagram could be a little bit better, but there's a hole in the side where you actually uh, deactivate the plunger after you shoot it. And that's going to go up towards your half moon. And that's it for that. And take these out. We're going to head uh, put two of them down on the side here. And this is what your afterburn crossbow knock is actually going to look like. You got a little plunger up here, which after your bolt goes flying, uh, this little plunger is going to be activated when you when you do the string. Basically, your knock's going to light right up, and then you'll be able to actually find your arrow. And over here on the side, whoops, hit, hit the thing, you're going to find that little uh, circle that they showed you in the diagram. Remember, I got a camera right in front of my face. Basically, all you're going to do is you're going to want to lift back up to turn it off. Now, to install it in your uh, on your bolt, all you're going to do is set that down right there. Now, take off your bolt or pick up your bolt. Uh, pick up your bolt. Take your half moon knock out. Go ahead and insert. Oh, if I can get on camera. All right, go ahead and insert your, your half moon. Once you get it inserted, you're going to want to get this lined up with your string. So mine is just like this. Go ahead and grab that. And just make sure you're lined up with your uh, cocking vein down inside your shooting rail. And you're set to go. Let's go back up top and talk about the afterburn lighted crossbow knock. Alrighty, that was the afterburn lighted crossbow knock by afterburn. There you go. Uh, I picked these up from Archery Mall on eBay. I'll leave that link down in the description. You know, I only got one con for these things. Uh, now, overall, the lithium ion battery, it's an awesome battery. I mean, as long as you can get to it after you shoot it, so if you Get something, let it go off, be quiet as you can, get to your knock as fast as you can, turn it off. I've had them last all season. Uh, ones that I haven't used lasted the whole entire next season. So it all depends on how many times you use this, use this thing is going to determine the overall battery, uh, battery life with these things. So... It's going to add another 30 grains to your arrow or your bolt. And, you know, say like if you're shooting 100 grain broadheads like me, you know, you got 100 grain uh, field tips that you actually practice with. But for the knock itself, it's going to add 30 grains to your bolt. So you need to go put your practice tip back on, 
go shoot it a couple times, hurry up, turn it off, and, you know, check it out. But, you know, turn it off really quick. Make sure your flight hasn't changed at all. Make sure you're still right on and you're golden. Other than that, I got one con for this thing is how you turn it off. There's like that little hole that you see in the up and close. You know, I really wish it came with something. You know, you have to figure out something at home that you can use. Uh, you know, I was using the tack. Tack works the best. I mean, but who wants to put a tack in the top of their duffel bar in their hunting bag or in their little, then stick your hand in there and poke your hand on a tack. It needs to come with something like this that you can actually hook to like a, one of these little, if you got one of these little carabiners, so that way you can put it in your backpack, hang it up or clip it on something outside your backpack. Or if you do get something, you know, you can hurry up, unclip it, go like this and press it up other than, you know, going and in, going into your bag and trying to find a tack. I really wish they came with a carabiner and a tool to actually lift that up. That's the only kind I got for this thing. It's an awesome knock. Just make sure you get the inner diameter right for your cross, uh, your, your, uh, your crossbow bolt, and you'll be fine. So that's about all I got for you today. Till next time, be safe. Just get out there and get back to the hunt. I'm Brian, your host from Backwoods Adventure Incorporated, and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye. <laughs>